All right, guys. So when you need to pick out your tungsten, there's a couple things you got to think about. You got to think about what you're welding and how much amperage you're going to be using. So first, let's talk about the type. You have a green tungsten, a red tungsten, and then there's also some not so common colors. And then there's also purple tungsten. So the green tungsten is a pure tungsten. It's going to be great for all your aluminum welding. The red tungsten, it's a thoriated tungsten, and that's going to be great for all of your DC applications. But then we also sell the purple tungsten. It's going to let you do everything the green and red tungstens do. Now you can weld aluminum as well as your steels with one tungsten, and you don't have to worry about making sure you have the right one. So now that you have that figured out, we're going to talk about size. We sell 1 16th tungstens and 3 32nd tungstens. These are going to be your two most popular sizes. There's some other specialty sizes available as well, but they're not that popular. The 1 16th is going to be perfect for up to around 100 amps. And the 332nd is going to be perfect for everything over 100 amps, up to around 200 to 250 amps. So it's that easy. All you got to think about is what you're welding and how much amperage you're going to need. When you're using a purple tungsten, you don't even have to worry about what you're welding. Now, I highly recommend grabbing a tungsten grinder if you're starting out. You're going to have to keep these tungsten sharp. And when you're starting out, you're going to have to resharpen them a lot. So for more information about this and other tech tips, visit eastwood.com.